Hi, welcome back to Learn Me Some English's daily news podcast, 79. Today's article, Russian opposition leader moved to Arctic prison. My name is Jean Meesom. You can find me at www.learnmeasomenglish.com and find this article and many more at www.engoo.com. I put out these daily news podcasts Monday to Friday. Today, I will give you the vocabulary. I'll give you the word, the definition, and an example sentence. I will then read the article to you and in the end, give you some comprehension questions, which I would like you to stop and try to use full sentences and some of the vocabulary words to answer. Okay, let's begin with the vocabulary. One, extremism, noun. Holding extreme views, particularly those that promote violence. The Christchurch mosque shootings in 2019 highlighted the deadly consequences of far-right extremism. Two, conviction, noun an official statement in a court of law that someone is guilty of a crime. He had a prior conviction for armed robbery. 3. Gulag, a system of prison labor camps with extremely harsh conditions. In the 1930s, millions of innocent people were forcibly sent to Soviet gulags. 4. Nerve agent noun, a chemical that damages the nervous system. The nerve agent Novichok was developed in the Soviet Union in the 1970s. 5. Associate, noun, someone you know through your work or business activities. This is Anthony, an old associate of mine. 6. Trace, verb, to find or discover by investigating. Police eventually trace the suspect to an address in New York City. Okay, and here's the article. Title of today's article, Russian opposition leader moved to Arctic prison colony. Russian opposition leader Alexei Navalny released a statement on December 26th about his transfer to an Arctic prison colony nicknamed the Polar Wolf. His first appearance since associates lost contact with him three weeks ago. Navalny, the most prominent Russian opponent of President Vladimir Putin, is serving a 19-year sentence on an extremism conviction. He had been imprisoned in central Russia's Vladimir region, about 230 kilometers east of Moscow. But supporters said he couldn't be found beginning on December 6th. On December 25th, they said that he had been traced to a prison colony known for severe conditions in the yamalo nenets region, about 1,900 kilometers northeast of Moscow. I am your new Santa Claus, Navalny said in a tweet, referring to his location above the Arctic Circle in the prison in the town of Kharkiv. The region is famous for long and severe winters. The town is about 100 kilometers from Urtica, whose coal mines were among the worst of the Soviet gulag prison camp system. Navalny who is noted for sharply humorous comments, said he was in a good mood after being transported to the new prison, but suggested the northern winter darkness is discouraging. I don't say ho, 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 but I say oh, 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 when I look out the window, where I can see night, then the evening, and then the night again. Prison transfers in Russia often result in contact with the prisoners being lost for weeks. Novani's supporters say the transfer was arranged to keep Novani out of sight after Putin's announcement that he will run for another term as president in the March election. Novani has been behind bars in Russia since January 2021, when he returned to Moscow after recovering in Germany from nerve agent poisoning that he blamed on the Kremlin. Before his arrest, he campaigned against official corruption an organized major protest against Putin's government. He has since received three prison terms, but has rejected all the charges against him as politically motivated. Now on to the comprehension questions. One, do you know much about Alexei Navalny and his political activism in Russia? Two, 
What is your opinion of Vladimir Putin? Do you expect him to win another term? Three, how closely do you follow European politics and elections? Four, would you say your country's relationship with Russia has changed since the invasion of Ukraine? Five, what countries do you imagine have the worst prisons in the world? I hope you enjoyed today's article. Again, my name is Jean Meeson. You can find me at www.learnmeesomeenglish.com. I put out these daily news English podcasts Monday to Friday. Thanks for listening. Hope to see you again next time and have a great week. Bye.